ready. All right, it's recording. Hi. Hey, it is time for a Chalgren Showdown video. I'm Bernie, and this is my lovely wife, Jess. Sorry and, for the whiteout. The sun's out and it's bright. Yeah. So for those of you who tuned into our uh, drunken uh, gingerbread house uh, video, thank you. Uh, yeah, that's all I'm going to say is thank you. We appreciate the support, <laughs> and you now know why we don't excel in carpentry. But... <laughs> We do excel in our new segment of I've never had, or in this case, it'd be we've never had since we've never had these. Look, whoops. Oh, that's the back of the box. Look what I found. Yeah, this, oh, yeah, now this is verboten. It's very popular on the East Coast. In fact, they give you the history. I guess it's the 100 year anniversary of Malamars, or was. Created by Nabisco in 1913, sold to a grocer in West Hoboken, New Jersey. This metropolitan New York City area boasts the most loyal Malamars fans. More than 70% of all sales are generated in the shadow of the Big Apple. And this has been considered to be one of the best cookies of all time, according to the East Coast. So we didn't know about it, uh, or we knew about it, we just never got them in the area. But Hy-Vee and Egan, they had them, so... Yep. And since we just had moon pies when we were down in Tennessee, I'll be interested to see the difference between moon pies and Malamars. Yeah, Malamars are just basically open faced s'mores. Just yeah, they don't have the other wafer on top like moon pies do. Like, there's a bottom wafer and a marshmallow and a chocolate. So. Mm. 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 Let's get a good look in here. That looks pretty good. You got the graham cracker marshmallow covered in chocolate. It's a dark chocolate too, isn't it? I believe so, yeah. It looks darker. I can definitely understand the hype in in New York, how the New Yorkers swear by them. The chocolate has got a nice little uh, crunch to it when you bite into it. Marshmallow is very soft, very chewy, and the graham cracker has also got a nice little crunch underneath too. Is it better than a moon pie? Well, uh, yes and no. Yes in the sense that there's a ton of them in this box, all 18, whereas Moon Pie is just one big old pie. How much was that box? This was five bucks for 18 cookies, so That's I'd say it was totally good. worth it. Yeah. All right, all right your okay. turn. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's pretty good. I actually think I like that better than moon pie. It's less, it's less marshmallow because I feel like moon pies are like I'm just gonna melt a little marshmallow. Yeah, and the sweetness factor is and not is overpowering at anything. This is definitely a dark chocolate. Yeah. So on a one to ten scale, how would you rate Malamars? I'm an eight. An eight? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I definitely give these about eight, eight and a half. No, an eight. These are definitely worth it. It was worth the five bucks we paid for it. I think before winter time comes to a close, we'll have to go get another box. Mm -hmm. So, all you East Coast East Coasters and uh, everywhere else, if you've had Malamars, what do you think? Comment down below and uh, click, so click subscribe so you don't miss any more of our videos and follow us on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and we'll catch you later. Bye.